welcome to learn uk history finders this morning don't cock your leg anywhere somebody has just come in and bought a sand scoop and uh, it still had still had uh, sand on all these coins so we're just down at tom pisserex uk history finders shop his buddy darren smith uk's foremost beats detector has just popped in and tom's made a t-shirt uh this is uh your new logo darren yeah is that your logo your logo for for, for youtube <laughs> well done tom well done mate uh, this is uh one of the reasons why i come down to see tom today viewers uh pick up the manticore uh i'm not an out and out mine lover in fact i always struggle with them but you know i will i'll put six months on this machine and hopefully learn it and get the best out of it so thank you everybody who watches the channel and obviously all the lovely people who helped me buy the machine. Let's go and see what we can do with it, innit, over the coming months. So yeah, I've come down to UK History Finders today. My new sponsors, you can find them on the internet there. And this is some of the wares that they sell. We've got, they carry the XPs, they do. Uh, this that's my new manticore over there we we'll just put it together got loads of peripherals like you know screen covers all kinds of uh, printed stuff one sack Bunty's uh, caught himself up in the stock oh look what he's doing he's pulling the shelves off oh Bunty Bunty you have to pick them up in a minute now uh, what Tom uh, carries loads and loads of 3d printed goods for all kinds of machines, uh, hold your power noxes in, cable tidies, bumpers for the boxes, you name it, Tom's got uh, a 3D printed product for pretty much anything. He's got the coil tech coils, all the spades, everything you see in, in, your, in a well stocked detecting shop. Any of you like your Rutus? He's even got the Rutus. He sells all kinds of like um, cool things like that clock. Uh, yes, so get down, see Tom, or get on the internet. I'll show you the website again in a minute. Carries all the Noctas look as well. And yeah, he's even got all the, all that. Anybody who's tempted with an air detector, he's even got that. All right, Bunt. Come on, we've got we've got to tidy this up now. What, one of my admin in uh, the only app left, is it? One one of my admin in Anglo Celtic. He wants sponsorship off Tom, but he's going to have to earn it. I don't know what he's going to have to do for Tom, but he wants one of these hats. But what what's this guy's name, Tom? Which one? What's the guy's name? Mikey. 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 Mikhail. Ma 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 He's Polish. Mikhail or something. He's half Polish, half Chinese. Half Polish, half Chinese. It's the only hat left in the shop, Mikey. And uh, Mikhail needs it for now. We're, you start working away. See what you can do for Tom. And then we'll we'll talk in about a month or two. All right, mate? How did you get into the same? I just want to show you some of his other products. Got massive full range of the, even the budget budget range pinpointers got the dr otax there even Point, pinpointer for every price range uh I'd, I'd pay if you're on a budget and you're coming into the hobby i'd try and spring for the 89 pound one but yeah and uh he's got all kinds here that is all 3d custom 3d printed loads and loads of it it's got all your uh, coil stiffeners stuff for the uh, shafts it's got everything he's got loads of uh, coin display things tons and tons of stuff all kinds of stuff to hang off your belt plastic little diggers if you was uh, going really carefully another cool clock up there these are flasks, so oh, that's a cool looking flask that. Um, coasters, cups, you name it. 
they've got it at UK History Finders. They really have, so yeah, definitely jump on the website, which I will flash up again at some point. It's still nothing but rain and it's tea time now and I'm back at Tom's and these are the UK History Finders chickens and it's still raining. Me and Buster are staying at uh, Tom's house tonight, viewers. And we haven't even got to the pub yet. And he's given me four different Polish spirits, all in this glass. We've had some sausages. He's been showing me his, uh, his clay pipes. And we're just about to go to the pub for a steak. Proper old school pub, this. It's lovely, though. This has got a piss in a grid. Right, viewers, uh, what's this pub called? It's called the New Inn, isn't it? In the bowels of a little Devon village. Buster's fast asleep. Me and Tom have just finished our lovely steaks. Not in Australia, Tom. Here's to you. I, I look forward to sponsoring your shop. <laughs> oh, here's, here's the good friends, Tom. And I've really enjoyed my little visit today. Where you would you like to give everyone a shout out? Shout out to everyone. <laughs> what about Dan Smith? Steak was lovely, mate. <laughs> oh yeah, you should have been here, Darren. Tea, tea we've got. We've got a little, little spare room in Tom's house. You, you behave yourself. Oh, he's got, he's got a lot of his, um, his little trophy stuff up here. Fair play. Oh look. Now that is a stunning ring that he found, actually. Fair play to you, that Tom. Oh wow, I do like that. Fair play, Tom. It's nice, that mate. Dog child, you've got to get up, mate. You've got to get up, lovely dog child. You've got to drive back to you from, from Devon, mate. Tom's got a board here with loads of lovely patches on from all around the metal detecting UK community and Polish, all kinds of diggers, Lithuanians there, everything. Uh, I'm just going to talk you through them all now. Wang, 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 wang. Good guy, good guy, good guy. Wang, 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 wang. Good guy. All right, Tom was telling me that uh, Adam Trutchewicz, uh, our lovely friend from Team of the World, I think he's the captain of the Team of the World, he made this from Thames finds. There's actually coins in it as well. And I'm not a big one for displays myself in my little flat. But Adam, shout out, mate. That is skills, that, that is pure skill. Hey, little dog child egg. Little kinder dog egg. Is your eye gonna work today? Or is that stuck stuck together again? There's an eye in there somewhere, but oh bless you. Get you some more eye drops from the vetti, eh? Oh just every day is a blessing. Every day is a blessing. Shout out to my lovely friend Alice up near Edinburgh and her beautiful doggy Rosie today. I won't go into it, but I'll be thinking of Alice today and her beautiful patties and family. God bless you, Alice. Right, viewers, I'm not uh, a fan of big, clumpy-looking wellies, but I've just picked these up, and there's no weight to them. There's absolutely, they look heavy. You can't, they're about as light as a pair of trainers. So I'm going to take a pair of these with me, and uh, I suggest you have a look at them, because they're only 40 quid. Tom's been training me up. I've just sold my first sim. I've just sold my first simplex to Michael down there. And uh, good luck, guys, on the beaches and out in the thank field. You. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, thank you. Great machine as well. So I'm home now. Got my Wellingtons off Tom. And honestly, these were this was the most su surprising technology in the shop. We know all about the, the machines that, that they sell. And their tech, but these, these light tech, honestly, get onto Tom's website, it's on the front banner of the videos. 
that is just, that whole thing is as light as a training shoe. Literally, is you know, I didn't even pick them up in the shop because I thought, oh, they look like silly builders. Well, he's too heavy, but they're not. They're just the opposite, and they are firmly insulated down to 35 degrees apparently. Love my pink neon, and he's even put a, a really tough screensaver on it for me. God bless you, Tom. Thanks, mate. Just need to uh, work out how to switch it on or... Shit, how do you switch it on? Fuck Oh my god. Oh, I don't know. I'll give up. I'm gonna have to send it back. Australian shite. I fucking knew it. I don't know why I got talked into it by all the fanboys. Go out for like one minute out the front to, to do a bit of video on the Wellingtons and what well, you've uh you've bagsied my manticore yeah dad I, I'm gonna find more stuff than you and uh I'll trade it in for tuna fish all right Till well you are the boss mate whatever you say <laughs>